I'm gonna my shoes. Oh, hey Mike. Hey Nathan. I finally got the hair pomade on my hair, and uh, also I just put on these shoes. Kind of oldish. They're my brothers, but it's whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, speaking of things, where's James? I want to go tell Sophia the bad news. Oh. When will he be back? Today? Tomorrow? Mm mm. Eh, we need to tomorrow. Alright, well, uh, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go. <coughs> <visit my brother. coughs> I'm gonna go visit my brother's grave. Okay. I'll, I'll meet you in the stables. Alright. <coughs> Sucks that you die from pneumonia. You're missing a whole heap of this world. This world's crazy right now. <sighs> Man. And I'm finally back at the house to visit you. <sighs> Love you, brother. Let me go pick some flowers. I'll bring them to you. Alright. Let me just get some of these. Alright. Let me just get some of these for him. Alright, let me go bring him to him. Here you go, brother. Brought you some flowers like I promised. Now I gotta go. So, see you later. Let's go see if Mike has the horses ready. I'm surprised we even have cows still. Thought those bandits might have took them. But, it's whatever. I think I know a house in the area. That we could probably look for closing. Uh. Mike. Mike. Yeah. Oh. Seems like you got the horses ready. I just got done yeah. uh, giving my brother some flowers, and um, uh, there's actually a house in the area that I heard of that somebody, like a gang. Came in like some of Driscoll's men cabin. You know those big oh. like people that yeah. kind of run Valentine. Yeah, I heard that they left their little cabin and they like they rushed out of it. So there's like some supplies maybe there. I mean I'm down to look for some. You want to? Oh yeah, sure. All right, I think it's up this way. I don't really know. <coughs> that cough is getting pretty bad. I don't know. Yeah. Yep. Well, I think this is the right path, so let's just keep following it. Okay, I think this is it. The old O'Driscoll camp. Oh, yep. Jesus, it looks abandoned. We could probably find some things, like maybe food. I don't know. Yep. Hopefully clothes. I think the clothes might be in the house, though. Cause this hey, look. A chest. Wait, wait. Let me see. Oh, that's a buddy. How much? One dollar. No. Two dollars. Oh. Eh, that's not enough. Uh, I don't think we're going to find much. They, it looks like they packed up and ran. Maybe, like, the sheriff tried finding him. Hey, look. What? Dang it. The lock doesn't come off. <sighs> Jesus, it must be rusted on there. Well, let's check this house. It's gotta be our last hope. I don't think they have money. Uh, they gotta have took it with them. But the clothes? Oh, wait. Money. That was... I found three dollars on the floor. What is this? Hey, let me check. Let me what? check this uh, fire. I found place. a necklace. Oh, I found a ring. Nice. Okay, I found three dollars. You found a ring. I found a necklace. That three dollars and that two dollars probably all they had. Um, shotgun shells if you need them. Thanks. Some more shotgun shells in here too. I'll take the crackers though. Excuse me, Mike. I'm trying to take some crap. Yeah. 
just want to get some of these crackers. Oh. Sure. Oh. Never mind, I guess you can carry it. Let's see. Canned fruit. Ooh, Kentucky bourbon beer. Hey, Mike, I don't know if you want to be drinking. It doesn't make sense with your tuberculosis. You know it's kind of bad for you, right? Yeah, here it's true. It's whatever it is, it is your body. Let's I'm see. not going to do it. Um, what, what's that? Hmm. What's what? I'm not finding any luck over here. There's no clothes. Hold on. Let me check these tents. Oh! Help! There's a... Animal, we can eat it. Uh, uh, what? Get what? Uh, got it. Found us a raccoon. I found us a raccoon. Should I skin it? I'll do it. Well, I gotta learn someday, Mike. How do you I know do what? it? Sure. Um, you get your knife, okay? Yeah, but what happens if it's like a small thing? Do I peel it? I don't know. Uh, cut a hole when it's like ribcage and... You know what? I'm just gonna do it. You did it! Jesus. So weird. We got the, we, we got the meat, bro. Yeah. Well... I'm gonna put it on the horse. That took a lot of strength to do. Try to find us some more clothes, if you can, because I haven't found any clothes yet. Yeah. I found a buckle, oh! but... I found a shirt! Okay. That's, that's a start. What are two? Uh, there's a brown one over here. So that's two. Oh. Try to find pants. Um, these are bed rolls. We may have to sleep here for the night. There's no point of driving out in the morning. I mean, this late, you know. Oh, pants! What? Try to find some stuff. There's stuff all over the ground over here. I found pants. Um, I have boots on already. Oh, there's a pile of clothes over here. Come here, Mike. Mike, come here. What? There's a pile of clothes over here. Oh, let's see what we can find. Um, we'll put them on. I'm gonna put mine on in the morning. I'm gonna probably give me some yeah. rest. So, sure. yeah. There's more. There's a blanket over there. I guess this will be mine. All right. Well, good night. I guess this is mine. Good night. I'm gonna rest up. You wake me up in the yeah. morning. But it's time to go. Wait, Mike, what are we doing? Yeah? We can go sleep in that what? cabin. I've seen a couple of beds in there. Wait, yeah. All right, come on, let's go. Because it's raining, so. Ah! You okay? I'll get my lantern. All right, I'll sleep on this. This little, I'll sleep on know, this. I'll sleep on this mattress. You have that bed. All right. Good night. Good night. I think he's still asleep. Yeah, he is. Let me just go try to put on these clothes and I'm gonna head to Valentine. It's pretty early, but it's okay. Let's go find those clothes that I was gonna put on. I left them at the tent. All right, let me put these on. Hey, these clothes are okay. I mean, they're definitely not my type, but it's whatever. In Valentine, need to give me a little drink. Maybe a cup of water. I don't know. Let me hitch my horse here. Then when I'm done, I'm going to probably go visit my parents' grave and head back to Mike. Alright. Let me 
go get me something to drink. Uh, a drink, please. Okay, there you go. Thanks. Who's this little 16 year old kid in here? He's not allowed drinking in here. What did you say to me? You heard me, son. Is that so? I'm old enough to be your son. Then, that means I'm old enough to drink. Get out of here. You don't tell me what to do. I'm not leaving. I don't care what you say. Whoa! Get out of here. Stop! Oh, hell no! What is wrong with you? Jesus! Get off me! What is wrong with you? Somebody help! This guy is trying to attack me! Jesus! Whoa! What do you want? I can't drink? Sorry, whoever horses is. Stand back, I'm not afraid to shoot. Jesus, this is a horrible day. See, now who's gotten you tackled? Ghost! Get off me! Leave me alone! God. Why can't I drink in a bar? God, it's crazy. Must have some issues. I don't know. That was the most horrible bar experience. Reminds me of when I was fighting Jake with, uh, James. I'll take a beer. Sorry about that, kid. You know, uh, he's kind of the bad bandit of the town. Yeah, it's okay. It's not your fault. Yeah, my face. I'm probably gonna go visit my parents' grave and then get out of this town. I knew it. This town's always been cursed and always will be cursed. Let me get out of here. Jesus. I still have that raccoon. We gotta save that with Mike. Right. Man. Need to catch my breath. Alright. Probably gonna have to go tell my parents about this bad day. I lost that hat, but I didn't really like it anyway. Alright. Let's see. You stay here, Queen. I'll be back. Alright, Dad. Sorry that the bandits killed you. I wish I was there to save you. But, you know, everyone dies. People come and go in your life, so I just have to be happy that you were there. And Mom, I visited my brother's grave earlier. Rest in peace. Let me get out of here and head back to Sheriff Mike. It's a long, crazy day. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. It's getting pretty late. I should probably head to James and Sophia's, uh, well, Sophia's grandparents' house, I guess you can say. Because I am pretty close. Oh, there's Sophia's horse. And her, uh, grandparents' dog. Nice. Let me just hitch my horse right here. There you go, girl. Man inside. I haven't actually been here before, but James showed me this place, you know. Alright. Hopefully they're still home. Well, obviously. Her horse is outside. Oh! Hey, hey guys. guys! Nice one! Oh! Hi. Hey, kid. Oh, Sophia, you let your hair down? Nice. Yeah. I finally took the pomade on my hair. Yeah. I was thinking about... 
Not any time soon, but later in life, if I could grow on my hair, like long hair, that might be cool. Yeah, um, excuse me, Sophia, James, come on. Huh? So, how's it, how's, how are you doing? Oh, Sophia, don't, don't worry, yeah, just stay inside for a little bit, you know, yeah, it's just okay. a little bit. How has life been going? Um, been okay, but, um, come on, yeah. let's get away from You know, um, last time I saw Mike, well, not last time, but... It was last, just a couple but, hours ago, right? Or No, actually, it was yesterday. Yeah, um, he said he had a cold. Is everything all right? Yeah, it's getting better. But, um, did you, um, tell Sophia, those, did you tell Sophia about the house? Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. All right, uh, uh, shall we... All right, you want to do it or me? Uh, let's both do it, come on. All right. Okay, uh, Sophia? Sophia, um, we have some news. Yeah. You might want to so sit down for this one. When you were at, I think, your grandparents' house, basically, uh, Jake found us at your little house, the little farm, and he kind of burnt it. And he killed all your cows. Yeah. Ooh. He 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 burned down my house? Yeah. yeah. And the dogs? Yeah. They're dead, too. All of it. Even the donkey. It's okay. It's okay. Sorry, but I need to be alone right now. Okay. This is the sacrifices we have to make to live life, my kid. Oh, man. I know. I just wish we could always just lie, 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 but it's not how it works. I wish life could just go back to being how it was. My family alive, me living I those dreams. I should never, ever even talk to Jake. Without Jake... None of this would have happened. Yeah. And God forbid me, but it kind of also was your father's fault. He didn't listen to you. Exactly. I told him not to trust Jake. But of course, a casual homeless guy that was actually homeless, he let him into our house for no reason. But also, you did say your father had a kind heart and said, you know, he would like to help everyone. I wish I had the mind like that, but I can't trust nobody after what my family, you know, their death. I almost killed Mike for trying to kill me. Bad business, man. I mean, like, I don't know. I don't even know if that's the right call anymore. I kind of wish sometimes I didn't get into this drama that, you know, y'all dragged me into. I but hate it. I, I hate it so much. I don't, I don't like bad stuff happening. Sophia, what are you doing with that gun? I'm going uh, to kill him. No, 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 don't, please. Don't, please, you're going to get yourself we killed. We don't even know where, no, listen, he could be anywhere. Strawberry, Valentine, we don't know where he is. He killed my cows and my dogs, and he burned no, everything in my listen, house. listen, listen, we don't even know where he's at. Strawberry, he could be, he could, he, he could even be at Tumbleweed, we don't know. True. Plus, there's no time to get yourself killed looking for him. Who knows what he'll do to us next? Maybe kill us in our sleep. Maybe burn another house yeah. down. Okay. I'll put it away. We will get him, Sophia. Just you wait. I just wish I had Jake by the throat. I hate him so much. And even if we don't kill him, I wish the law finds him. I wish they hang him. No, 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 kid. I don't care about him getting in jail. I need him dead. You're right. I'm going to go tell Sophia to get the guns. Come on, Sophia. Let's get the guns. I'm getting my dual wield. We're going to go looking for him. Strawberry, tumbleweed, everywhere that we have to look. We're going to get him. I'm today... I don't care what it takes. I'm finding him and killing him. If it's not today, then it's soon. I don't care. Wait, Sophia. I don't know if you can go. Remember? Oh, yeah. You gotta watch your grandma. You said she was sick. Oh, yeah, true. But we'll get him for you, at least. Yeah, we promise. Okay. We'll come back with a piece of his head in our hands if we have to. Be careful. Yep. I'll probably come back with blood all over me, but it's all right.
Good luck, Sophia. And if he comes here, shoot him in plain sight. Yeah. Good luck. No holding back. Mm -hmm. Look, her dogs. Well, oh, come boy, on. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Get on. Um, I don't know where my horse is at. Just get on. We'll look for him. All right. He might be still at the ranch, you know? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Well, uh, should we head back to, uh, Sheriff Mike? Or Mike? I mean, yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, we found this little cabin up. It was like one of the abandoned O'Driscoll cabins. That's why I found these clothes that really don't suit me as well. Uh, so basically I got these clothes. Because Sophia told me that these were her grandpa's clothes. But they were still good, and she washed them a lot, so. Yeah. Not like, you know. I feel like if we could, we should have brought Sophia, but, you know, she has to watch her grandparents, because there's... Yeah, really... and she has to watch, watch the house just in case Jake finds her or something. And plus, we can't afford her getting killed. If me, you, and Mike are already going, it'll be a bloodbath. Here's the house, you know. You want to get everything that you need to get before we head out and go to Mike? I need to get, and I need to go tell my brother, you know, the last couple of news. Hey, bro. Like I said earlier, I wish you could have survived pneumonia, but, you know, it's strong, and it's too powerful to beat. Hopefully one day they make a cure for it. Love you, bro. Yeah, man. We're finna go kill somebody that caused wait, so much Wait, 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 wait. Is this your brother's grave? Yeah, he died from pneumonia when he was about, like, seven. Sorry about that. I kind of daydream for a little bit. Yeah, he's very, he was very young when he caught it. But, yeah, we're going to go get revenge on somebody. So, like I did earlier, I'm going to pick you some flowers. I'll be back. Listen, I might not know you, but your brother, he's been pretty nice to me so far, so... Don't worry about him. All right, let me just get these for him. The last bit of flowers over here in the area. My mom loved those type of flowers. Only if I could give her some Valentine. I'll pay her a visit too. I did earlier. Here you go, brother. Oh God. For you. All right, let's head out and let's go. All right, kid. You sure you want to do this? I mean, you're you're kind of young still. You sure? I do. I have to help you. After I mean, all, you don't listen, kid. Stop the horse. I need to talk to you. What? Listen, I know this is crazy with all Jake, and I don't want your life to get wrecked like mine. So I'm sorry I dragged you into this, but I don't know if you can keep going with us. You're young. You still have life to live. I don't want fine. your life to be ruined. It's fine. Come on. My life already Are you is sure ruined. You want to do this? It already is ruined. My whole family's dead. My mom. Right, whatever. My dad. My sister. My brother. I'm the last one. I don't care if he did nothing you to him. Kid? I'm still gonna put a lot of bullets in him. Just in case one of us don't make it. I'm sorry I dragged you into this. It's okay. And even if I don't make it, it's okay. I'm not afraid of dying. Me either. I just can't wait to see my dad again. Well, let's ride! Let's do this!